Hey everybody, this is Rita Reed and this is Purpose with Rita. Um, I just wanted to come back on today and just share something with you guys. So earlier when I was at work, my daughter called me and we were talking for a little while and she was telling me that she was trying to finish up her aspiration poster. And I said, well, what's an aspiration poster? And, I, and she's told me, you know, where I write my goals down, you know, things that I need to get done. And I thought like, oh, okay. I said, well, that's a vision board. And she said, no, it's not a vision board. She said, I'm not like everyone else. I call it an aspiration poster. She said, because a vision is just that. It's vision. She said, but this is where I write my goals down and I'm going to accomplish my goals. And I thought like, whoa, okay. So I just thought that that was very important for me to share with you guys because here I am coming on here every day trying to encourage you to write down your goals, to follow your dreams. And my daughter, who is 15 years old, is telling me that she's different, that she's stepping outside the box, that she's not going to be confined to what we all consider to be the vision board. She says, I'm ex I'm aspiring to get my goals done. I'm aspiring to do great things. And so I just wanted to share with you that if a 15-year-old can come up with her her goals and her dreams and tell me that she's stepping outside the box and that she's not like everybody else who has a vision board and that she has an aspiration poster. I'm just here to say that uh, some of y'all need to step your game up then if my daughter is saying that and she's 15. So I just thought that that was a very, very um, encouraging for me to hear her say because that means that something that I'm saying or something that I'm doing is rubbing off on her. And I remember when she was little, I had a, uh, I had a, a picture that I put in her room and now it's in my office, but I'm going to share it with you. It says, be legendary, challenge yourself, have imagination, be an individual, do the right thing, believe in your vision, find your own magic, have character, make a real difference, believe you can do anything and you will. And now I have that up um, in my office because now she's grown up and now not grown up but you know she's gotten older and now she has her room decorated with different things but um even in my office I just want to share with you a few things that I um that I have in here that just keeps me somewhat motivated in um some of the things that I do so I don't even know if I could turn this around I don't know if I can I don't know how to work this thing like that but anyway, I'll I'll turn this way and see if you can see some of my um, pictures that I have on the wall. But basically, what they say is, when in doubt, follow your heart. Chase after your dreams. Live for the moment. Always believe that something wonderful is just around the corner. So that just goes back to what I said to you guys earlier, that you have to wake up with a spirit of expectancy. You have to believe in yourself, but you also got to put forth the work. You have to continuously tell yourself that great things are going to happen to me today. And even when things don't happen the way you want them to happen, doesn't mean that things are not moving in your favor. You got to continue to move on. And then I have this other... Um, I just got so many little inspirational quotes like in my office. <laughs> and this one says, let's see if you can see a little bit of it. Maybe not, but but basically it says, no whining, be happy, do your own thing, enjoy life, and believe and believe and dream big. So everything is just for me, it's just motivational work hard, stay humble, and be kind. So with everything, you just got to keep moving forward. You just got to keep moving forward. But I just thought it was just very profound that my daughter said to me that she had an aspiration poster and that that was where she wrote her goals down and that she is different. She's not calling it a vision board and that's okay. Whatever you want to call it, whatever makes it stand out for you that is what you do so i am even encouraged even more so today because my daughter said what she said to me today and i thought that i would share that with you guys write your goals down write steps down to make that provision come into fruition do something different every day to get towards your goal every micro achievement celebrate it so that you feel good about every single thing that you're doing and never let people make you feel bad 
about following your goals, following your heart, following your gift. You do not need permission from anyone to be great. Step out into your greatness and remember other people's validation is not needed. So again, find your purpose. Know who you are. Walk in your power. Be great today. Feel good about who you are. Again, Purpose with Rita. Like, subscribe, share. Go to my website, RitaReed.org. Hit me up. Create a conversation. I am a life coach. If you would like to be individually coached, that's great. If you have a business and you would like me to come and coach multiple people in a group of 10, I'd be happy to do so too. Um, holla at your girl. All right. Until next time. Peace. Have a great night.